Hello Adventurers, welcome back to my time at Sandrock, and yep, I stayed up right until 3 a.m. in the morning and passed out outside. I was trying to get started on moving some stuff around, around the workshop and trying to get it better looking, but I only got to move two things before, well, I passed on the ground, but somehow I ended up in bed. Don't know how it happened, but uh, we're fine. I think um, we should be able to get the water tower done this morning, at least uh, a couple Howdy of the pieces. There. Oh. Rise and shine, ready for your surprise? Uh, I kind of forgot about the surprise, whatever it's supposed to be, but okay. I just wanted to say, even though we didn't find much poking around Logan's old homestead, well, you believed when almost no one else did. So, thanks, partner. But kind words ain't worth gills on a cat, so I did you one better and brought you this here baby Yakmel. His name is Doodles, but I reckon you can name him something else if you want it, because he ain't quite learned it yet. With Doodles... You could get started with your very own ranch. Uh, wow, thanks. Hear that, Doodles? You found a new and loving home. Hooray! Yeehaw! Oh, but shucks. You ain't got a barn, do ya? You can't take care of any animals if you don't have a barn. Maybe you'd like for me to explain a thing or two about raising animals? Uh, no thanks, I'll figure it out. That's you. Always figuring stuff out. Well, I reckon that about sums it up. I better be getting gone. I'm sure you and Doodles are going to be right as rain, and I just know you're going to take real good care of him. Or else. So long, partner. Thanks for or all else, your help. Um, well, I guess he would fall over and, um, you know. <laughs> uh, where, where did Doodles go? Is he in my inventory or something? Doodles? I, I don't know where Doodles is. He might be in my back pocket. I'm not too sure. Let's go to the commission building on a Sunday. Oh, I kind of forgot about doing inspections as well. So I may do a couple of those. So I'll check the board first to see what's uh, what's on the up and up. I shouldn't take nothing too complicated because I do want to get those water towers done. Or water tower. Uh, wooden storage. He wants three for 62. Uh, glass lenses are kind of easy to make. Iron dagger. For 129, you want a special one. You want a rare one. Uh, let's see. You want metal hinges, which I think are somewhat easy. Cast iron rods for 96. You want four of them. I'm going to take those. Why not? And let's see. 51, 18. Uh, iron dagger. He wants a rare one. And he took it because he's an idiot. Uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and try to do that. Uh, let's see. How are we doing here? Yeah, just barely staying a thousand points out of Yan, so I gotta make sure we keep it up. Uh, let's get the water tower done first because, well, that's what's on the assembly station. And hopefully all of our materials that we need, we got. Oh yeah, I was gonna do the inspection, but let's see. If, if I got time today, we'll swing back in and do it. I mean, we'll, we I think we do get workshop builder points for it. Not too sure. What is in here? Is this the last... Uh, from City Hall, on 28th of this month is the very own running of the Acmill Festival. On that day, the running of the Acmill will be held at the Wandering Y Ranch. If you're interested in joining the festivities, don't forget to sign up. Uh, uh, the 28th, whenever it is. Research Center uh, is now complete. Attach your blueprints to make check it for errors. Yep, we know that. Acquire that. And I do believe that is everything that we can research currently in the game. So, that's that. Uh, let's go ahead and get ourselves all of our due. Yeah, so the only thing I got moved last night before I passed out is the water tower and the fire generator. Uh, but in the meantime, let's see, what do we got here? We got we got stuff here. Uh, I don't remember what I was making and what should be ready. Uh, that's fertilizer. That's whatever that is. That's whatever that is. Yeah, I, I really don't remember what I was making. Uh, before I start making anything from the commission's... Uh, let's go ahead and see if I can finish up this. Uh, iron plates. Yep, we got those. Let's go ahead and pick that up. And we leveled up as well. So we got the water filter. Uh, let's see. Cast iron rods. Uh, let's see. Let's see. I got the water tank. Hang on a second. Um, I got too many things showing up on the missions. I can't see if I got everything done. Uh, apprentice for construction? Um, I need... Oh, I need to make the tower frame. All right. And, oh, oh, I didn't know I could move this. Oh, that was a mistake by me picking it up. I thought I had to go to Construction Junction to move that. Interesting. 
Uh, anyways, <laughs> uh, that seems to be kind of a trip of thing to do. I uh, wanted to do today. Tower frame. Let's go ahead and assemble this. And steel frame. Nope. Iron latches. We got those. Bronze pipes. Iron plates. Steel frame. Iron. What? I, uh, iron plate. Steel frame. Is that what I said? Six iron plates. Uh, iron plates here. Uh, I need steel bars. Uh, I think I was making steel bars. Hopefully I, di I did. Looks like I did. Uh, ooh, it takes three per. Ouch. Alright, uh, let's just start making those. Hopefully I was making more. Looks like I was. And we're making copper and bronze here. Um, can I make more steel bars? I can. Craft those on up there. And let's see. What else do I need? I need steel. Um, is it two steel crates? Steel frames. Steel frames. Two steel frames. I need cast iron. Ooh, I need a lot of cast iron rods. Uh, can I start making cast iron rods, please? Ooh, I am short on the steel. Maybe, I, maybe, maybe I've taken the wrong commissions. I may have. Uh, can I make the iron dagger? I don't make the iron dagger here. Oh, iron dagger is made probably with, with this little, little machine right here. Uh-oh. Steel bar. Uh, and I need twine. I need two twine. We can make... Ooh. From planting. Okay. Uh, I may have taken a couple commissions that are going to be a little bit more difficult than I wanted to. Raw material from fabric can be can be obtained. Uh, jute. Well, there's a couple places I might be able to get it. Is it Vivi that may have it? Let's go. Hopefully, Vivi has some jute. And if she doesn't, maybe she'll have the twine itself. Oh, right here. Uh, thin thread, rough cloth, basic, basic, basic feather. Uh, that's, yeah, those are words. Uh, no, she doesn't. No, she doesn't. I'm going to go in here. I don't think there's a register in here. I think the register is on the outside. So, okay. Um, yep. That ain't going to work. That is not going to work. Well, some was up the creek without a paddle. Uh, <laughs> all right, uh, we'll see what we... I mean, I could always decline the dagger. I, I would just uh, lose some points. I think we're going to go ahead and we're going to... Uh, where is that one here? Um, I'm going to give up. And I've only lost two reputation and three workshop points. My... Ooh, can I take another one, though? If I give one up, can I take another one? Uh, wooden storage, he wants three of them. Can I take another one? I can. Alright. So that works. That works for me. I still will keep the cast iron rods. I should be able to finish that today. I got the machines going. They're on it. We're making steel. It takes longer to make steel than I thought. Um, while we're waiting for all that stuff, let's go back in here actually and let's do some inspections. I think I've only done it once so far, so if you missed that, we're going to come up here. It should be... Yep. Let's go ahead and inspect. It's going to take me a moment to figure this out here. Uh, there are five things wrong with this. Uh, there's one. Uh, I forgot. How do you rotate here? Well, there's two. Oh, um, okay. Uh, we'll exit that one. So that one's done. Uh, let's see. I don't even look at it. I can tell that's bad. That's bad. Uh, let's see. That's bad. That's bad. So I only got to find two on each. Uh, did I misclick? I think I may have misclicked on that. Whoop, right there. Yep, misses. So I misclicked. Uh, we'll do that. Do that. 
Uh, these are rather easy compared to what... What the heck is that, man? Get that out of there. And then... Uh, yeah, they made those kind of easy, to be honest with you. At my time at Porsche, they were just a little bit harder than that. Or my eyes has gotten really keen and I know what I'm looking for. I have no idea. But those just seem rather simple. All right, so let's go ahead and make some of these wooden storages. While we're waiting for things to be built or crafted. Uh, let's see here. We want to make three of them craft. We got everything we need. And that should be it, right? Uh, missions, uh, this one right here. Let's go ahead and track that one there. And he is up there. Uh, so while that's going on, or while I'm waiting, actually, let me go ahead and... Do I want the water tower facing like that? I think so. Alright, so what I want to do next is... Yeah, let's go ahead and try to get our workshop area looking just a little bit better. Can I go back one more? I don't think so. Nope. Put the workshop there. Uh, let's see here. What is the next thing I want to do here? Let's grab the refiner. And... Let's see, I'm trying to figure out here... Yeah, let's just put the refiner right there for now. Civil recycler. I want it to face... Yep, no. Nope. That one there. Put that one there like that. Uh, I do have another recycler, so let's go ahead and grab this one here. I should upgrade this one sometime soon. All right, and the next thing I want to do is let's grab, let's grab these lovely little things here one there, one there, one there, one there. That way I can come over here and grab them just like, oh, yeah, wrong button. I didn't mean grab like that. That was kind of a, an oopsie. Let's see, it's rotated like that. Okay, E to collect in this game. Like that. And see, can I collect this? There we go. Alright, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and put the... Okay, let's see. So if I do this... No, nope, yeah, I think I was doing it the right way before. And then, oops, I got another. Oh, I'm trying to pick it up. Thank you. There we go. And let's throw this right there. Actually, no, that needs to be rotated. Like that. Now I got all these processors. Uh, tailoring machine level number one. Put that there. Let's see the grinder. Let's grab the other grinder. You don't realize how much uh, machinery and equipment you get until you start moving stuff around and you realize, man, we got a lot of stuff. But this is going to open up the workshop just a little bit. There's that. Uh, let's see, our drawing rack. Let 
this is just kind of getting the area roughly where it needs to be. Um, nothing's going to be too precise yet. But it's a start. And that just leaves our apprentice cooking station. Uh, let's go ahead and just throw that. Right there. Um, I should be able to upgrade this now, right? Frying pan, bloodstone, steel frames, and everything else we got. Uh, th then we'll get the chef's cooking station. So we'll upgrade this once we uh, once we get everything built that we need. Uh, let's see if we got those. Uh, what was I doing here? Those are iron plates. I'm waiting for more steel bars. All right, do I have enough of those? I do not. And steel frames. Well, I don't think I got enough to do any steel frames, do I? Steel frames. I can make one of them. Alright. Uh, I need to get some crafting done is what I need to do. While things are crafting, I noticed that it uh, looks like one of my commissions... Uh, is it Pen? No, Pen is the one I, I, I stopped doing the work for, for the Iron Dagger. Uh, wait, are you upstairs? It's pointing up. I don't think I've been up here, have I? Uh, no, wait, now you're telling me downstairs. Wait, interact. Hey there. Someone is rock walking around like a ghost. Um, okay, Sandrock Commission. Let's hand these in. Uh, confirm. Hey, you got that done quickly. Here's your pay. You earned it. Um, thank you, Owen. You're there somewhere. All right. Catch you next time. Uh, 755 ghouls, 89 workshop reputation. Uh, he's our associate and all that fun stuff. Let's get out of here because Owen's kind of scaring me a little bit. I do have a knowledge point I can spend, so let's go ahead and do that. I believe it's probably going to be into workmanship at the workshop. So let's see what we want to put that point into. I don't think I got much left. Uh, let's see here. I can either do this, which is put a point into gathering knowledge XP. Uh, sorry, gathering knowledge experience from logging and kicking trees increased by 10, which is something I rarely do. And food recovery recovers 10% more stamina. Um, oh, wait, I went the wrong one. Uh, workshop, repeat. Yeah, workshop. There we go. Uh, let's see here. Uh, the only ones available to me right now is either put a point into this, which is max that increase. And this will lead us to the growth of crops is sped up by 10%. Price of unlocked new backpack slots decreased. Ooh, this is looking good. And price of new land decreased. Uh... <laughs> We've already done a lot of that stuff. This will do fuel usage slowed by 10%. Let's actually put a point into this. Now I'll unlock these over here. Uh, backpack slots would be kind of nice, decreasing that. And starting in getting into crops, that would be nice. The growth of crops is sped up by 10%. Uh, so that would be kind of nice to get into that. Um, okay, so now we're just kind of waiting for some more cast iron stuff to be made and steel bars to be made. I think what, what I'm going to do is I got a couple of furnaces I would like to upgrade so I can probably get the process of uh, higher end material done. So let's see, I got these two to increase and I am making bronze pipes as we speak. So I I'm going to go ahead and upgrade these but in the meantime I'm still waiting for more one steel bar, another steel bar. Yeah, I'm just waiting for steel bars to come on in so we can go ahead and make some more stuff. Well, I went up and just talked to Amira and gave her a gift. Uh, I didn't have anything I gave her previously, so I gave her a pendant. And I got three relationship points, so that worked out uh, rather well. And actually, uh, social status with Amira... I'm technically now her buddy, so I do get 10% discount when consuming at the store. Um, so there is that. Uh, what is... Uh, I didn't think I had anything ready for Heidi yet. I'm coming actually in here because I want to see how much it is for a stable because, well, we got a baby Yakamil. So 
let's see what it's going to cost us to put down a stable. And actually, while I'm here, I would like to move the house. I just want to move that back. Right there. That's good. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. And let's see, where is, where, where do I do the chicken coop barn? Unbuilt. Um, oh, I need iron plates. I need bronze frames. Hold on, I better get a pen for this because if I don't write it down now, I'll have to keep coming back here to see what I want. But the iron plates are going to take a little while because we're making enough of those as well. It only costs a thousand ghouls, so I got the cash for that. So let's see, I need ten. It is iron plates, right? Iron plates. All right. Iron plates uh, and four, four bronze frames, and then it's ten. Is a hardwood planks? Yep, hardwood planks. All right, so we we got the ghouls for that. Uh, the house has been moved back. Uh, yes, let's go ahead and quit that. Um, do I want to talk to Heidi? I didn't think I was ready to talk to her. Oh, I never told you my birthday, did I? It's the 17th of summer, sandstorm season. Uh, nice and hot then too. Sometimes it can be hard to convince people to get out and celebrate when sand is blowing sideways and it's 45 degrees outside. Uh-huh. Alright, uh, I'm going to go back and uh, wait for that stuff to be built because... I guess when you're making iron planks and such, it takes a little bit longer than ordinary stuff. So, <laughs> maybe I'll go and do some gathering in the meantime because I got some stamina to burn. Haven't got to using my stamina up because I noticed there was a couple of arrows on the map and the mysterious man, someone I have not oh, talked to. Another loyal customer just appeared. People call me the mystery salesman. Always a pleasure. Now, if I remember, if it's anything like my time at Porsche, he could just sell just about anything. How fortunate of us to have cross paths. It just so happens that you're my first customer of the day. Tell me, how's your brother doing? Um, as far as I know, I don't have one. Perfect. That reminds me. I'm looking for someone to cooperate with on a little side gig of mine. If you're the right person for the job... There could be a lot of profit to be made. Want to hear my offer? Um, sure, why not? You know of cooking, right? Basically, it's building with food. Hence my interest in working with you. No, no. No need to find a professional chef. That'll be too pricey. Anyway, I was traveling through Seaside, and I picked up a few of their signature peppers. They range from the super spicy to the hyper-numbing to the ultra pungent, all uniquely delicious, borderline nutritious, and go well with just about any dish. And by any dish, in this case, I mean noodles. As something of a noodle connoisseur myself, I have a keen nose for what makes them pop. My thoughts are that these peppers may very well hold the key to reaching noodle nirvana. But why stop at just filling our stomachs when we could fill our wallets as well? <laughs> I'm sure that once someone creates the dish I have in mind, people will be lining up for decades just to get one whiff of them. Me? Oh, I don't cook. Which brings me to my point. You have a cooking station. That makes you as qualified as anyone. Once you get the dish right, I'll sell the recipe all around the free cities. We'll do it real fair, real amicable-like. Nice and square. 70-30. Um, I'm going to say 50-50. Well, well. Someone's acting shrewd. I tell you what. I'm in a good mood today, and I like your backbone. 50-50 it is. I'll concede a bit and give you my peppers, but don't think my first offer wasn't fair now. Yeah, well, since I'm doing most of the work and cooking, I mean, yes, you gave me the peppers, but good. we'll see. It's a deal, then. Now. My only hope is that you might succeed where others have failed. For this dish, let me be as precise as possible. You'll first need a bone broth as the base, and the noodles should be handmade with flour. 
Before boiling them, you'll need to add some leafy vegetables, as well hold on, as some hold on, seasoned fresh meat. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, boil? Before, oh, before boiling them, you'll need to add leafy vegetables. All right. Leafy veggies, and well as some seasoned fresh meat. Uh, seasoned fresh meat. That's not just fresh meat, but seasoned. All right, so let's see. A bone broth as a base. Yeah, I got that. And then we got to make flour, which I can do currently. Before boiling them, you'll need to add some leafy vegetable and some seasoned fresh meat. Uh, what else has he got to say? Then it's time to add my seaside peppers. And then add peppers. I've blended 18 peppers and spices together to make my own secret seasoning. My senses are tingling just thinking about it. Builder, if you pull this off, we'll become a part of culinary history. In any case, you'd best figure this out in the next three days. You know how I roll, right? Can't stay in any place for more than three days. Usually it's two. I'm doing you a favor here. Plus, there are others out there who can build things with food, you know. Three days, huh? Come find me when you've created the dish. Okay. Um... <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe I'm not quite ready for that either. Uh, who knows? Anyways, we gotta come down here and... Wow, I kind of forgot his name already. Uh, wait, where, where is that? Uh, to the graveyard, is it... Uh, Wait, where am I going? Yeah, up here. Graveyard shack. Come on, Builder. Hop to it. I want to say his name begins with M. I can't remember. It does. His name is Mort. Ah, that's it. Oh, oh, wait. Ah, this is... Not that's it. This is... Though I'm glad to have this back, the memories that come with it are unpleasant. Who could have known where things would go? Ah, so is that what Sandrock looked like way back in the day? That old fool Dyson, he believed Sandrock killed uh, countless hidden treasures. One day, one of his men fell into the hole and it turned out he was right. The old world metropolis is under our feet held untold amount of relics, mostly intact, too. Countless folk rushed in after that. Vegetation was tampered, water was squandered, and animals lost their homes. Only the roar of machines and an inspirable, uh, inspirable haze were left here in Sand Rock. Martle, Martles and my regrets meant little to the newcomers, and once the railways was open, there was really no stopping them. We had to watch those relic rush miners Pluck every petal of our desert flower, and soon there was nothing left. Young one, thank you for bringing this to me. It feels good to share these old stories with someone who will hear them. Please stop by if you find any more of my photos. All right, Mort, I'll get out, get off your back, literally, and uh, head out, head back out the door. Because now I got to go back and figure out uh, this recipe. Um, I got three days to do it. And currently, I'm kind of busy doing a whole bunch of stuff. But um, I'll find time to do it one way or another. Hey there. Before we go back to the store, I forgot to check his store. What does he so have available? Uh, he's got the peppers, cilantro, garlic, relic bag, furniture chest, uh, leisurely rat and chair... Tea table, vintage pistol, wristbands. A lot of apparel. Large storage box. Bigger than the medium storage box, place this box on top of a smaller one to replace it. The smaller box will return to your backpack. Those are expensive. Uh, right now they're expensive. All right. Now that that, that won't mean that I won't have it next time. You could show up next time. And I haven't have any of that stuff. All right. I'm gonna try to burn some of my stamina by go uh, 
hammering on the bus and hopefully when I get back to my workshop a lot of the stuff will be made and maybe I can finish off some of this stuff. Well, I do have four cast iron rods, which is what uh, what we need to finish off one of our commissions for the day. Let's talk to Heidi. Hey there. Repair the water tower. We got your four cast iron rods. Let's go ahead and confirm that. Thankfully, hopefully we make the water tower a bit more resilient to attacks. Though I gotta say, I didn't expect to be looking into the defensive capabilities when repairing it. So long, partner. So a good amount of ghouls, workshop reputation, hiding reputation, and experience. Um, I'm not too interested in the fireside meeting tonight. I need to go on back and keep on making some more stuff for the tower, for the water tower. The last step, the last uh, one of the three things we got to build. Still making some stuff on that. I spent a little bit of uh, stamina chopping up the bus and some of the other stuff around here. Just gathering up materials. That's all I'm really doing currently. All right, it is almost uh, one o'clock in the morning. I made myself a frying pan so we can come over here to our cooking station and upgrade that. I needed a frying pan, bloodstone cores, which I made. Uh, I do have a steel frame though. I don't know if I want to do that because I need to need the steel frame to complete this over here. Uh, I have enough iron plates. Let's go ahead and put those on. So now I just need one more steel frame. That's why I don't want to use it on that. Uh, I am making a cast iron rod there and that will be able to help me make the last steel frame for the tower. So I'll wait in that. Uh, in the meantime, let me come over here and... Um, apprentice cooking station. Can I not make flour here? Uh, let me go to cooking pot. Can I not make flour? There was some place I can make flour. Where do I make flour? I don't remember. Wait, is it in the blender? There's my fertilizer. Uh, might be in the blender I can make flour. There we go. It's in the blender. Uh, let's go ahead and just chalk that up all the way. Um, and then craft. Can I do more than... Uh... Let's see, wait. Is there anything else I need to make? Uh, five, strawberry jam. Uh, no. Can I do another... Q full, so I can only make one thing at a time, which is fine. I did have to go buy some water because we were getting low on the water. So our water tower is kind of full. And how is the fire generator? Let me go ahead and add some some juice to that. Let's go ahead and do the power stones. There we go, that is good to go. Alright, so hopefully the cast iron rod will be ready in the morning. Uh, let's see, can I make any more... Boy, I, 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 we're just about out of, out of everything here. Um, I did upgrade all of our furnaces to civil furnaces, and so then we got all five of those going. And of course, I got all of my recyclers going. I need to make another ore refinery because the two I had, remember I gave that off as a quest. But let's go ahead and go to bed. As you can see, my stamina is also kind of uh, low. I've been using on up. I went out and hammered on some rocks and some stuff to gather up some materials. Let's go to bed, wake up in the morning. Hopefully, we get the water tower done. Um... Yeah, the water I went and bought up at Burgess's place. It, it took about just about all my ghouls, so I'm kind of broke. So <laughs> I need to get some more money, some more cash back in. Uh, yeah, I, he's going to say I need to get to bed earlier and earlier because I've been staying up rather late. Okay, so first thing is let's go and get ourselves two commissions for the day. And then we'll come on back and see what we need to do here. But I uh, definitely need to go back into the ruins at some point because I am low on materials. And hopefully at some point, we can stop doing stuff for the city. <laughs> at some point, just for a day or two would be nice. Gather up some materials. So, so we're making the flour for the noodles. I got, a, I got, I think yesterday counts the day. He's going to give me three. So I got today and tomorrow to kind of figure it out here. Uh, hardwood planks is something I need myself. Uh, glass lenses for 53. All right, let's go ahead and do the glass lenses. That should be kind of simple. And let's see, 51 for bloodstone saws. Um, I don't know if I got enough bloodstone. I use it quite a bit to upgrade a lot of my stuff. Uh, copper pipes. All right. Um, hardwood planks, hardwood planks. Thick rope. Five bloodstone saws. All right, he's going to take it. Uh, see what I can get done here. Hey, Mian, I beat you. I beat you for a change. 
All right, glass lenses, I should be able to knock out. Easy peasy, nice and easy. Uh, the bloodstone saws, I don't know. I did got, go around and uh, hammer out some stone last night. So maybe I gathered enough bloodstone. Might be something going on to, at the Blue Moon Saloon. Oh, the week might be up. I may have to start growing some more crops, but we're kind of uh, almost there. Let's gather up our dew. I may want to make more of these, actually. All right, there's that. Uh, let's go ahead and gather up some material here. Let's go grab those first. Let's come over to here so we can make our glass. Uh, first off, glass lenses. Uh, okay, I can only make two. That's fine. Uh, steel frames, let's go ahead and craft that. Bloodstone saws, I can only make... Ooh, I can only make two of those. I need more bloodstones. Uh, bronze pipes, I think it said I needed, right? So let's go ahead and get some bronze pipes working. Uh, wait, bronze pipes are going to be here. Uh, I don't want eight. Can we, can we, can we tone that down? Why can't I, uh, there we go. Uh, we'll just make four. All right, we're good there, I think. Uh, let's come over here, and we got that. Let's go ahead and pick that up. Oh, that's a perfect tower frame. Ooh, some better material here. Uh, let's see, we got the flower up and made. So, I need more bloodstone cores. I am making bronze pipes to go ahead and... Uh, for glass lenses. Let me grab these steel bars. I'm going to need some more iron. Iron, 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 iron plates. Let's go make how much as we can, which is only two. Yeah, we're just getting low on material. I think I got all the stuff I need for the tower. So while things are being done here, let's go get that done, I think. And hopefully we get a lot of ghouls for doing this. Not that I'm trying to be greedy about the whole thing, but uh, I've been spending a lot of my cash recently. Uh, let's see, that should be... I would assume it's just here. Take a hint. I may need a hint. So this is where the water tower was before. I do have all three. Maybe I should get the, my commissions up. Uh... You finished your half of the job. Time to take your component to the oasis and install, install your part. Okay, so it is here. Um, okay, so I gotta go down the steps. Install water tower component. Alright, let's go ahead and build that. Install water tower component. Yep, we got that. And install water tower and component. We got that. That's why the water is expensive. I forgot we didn't have you a water tower. did a mighty fine job once again. Just in time, too. I believe our next shipment of water is scheduled to arrive tomorrow. Our commissioner, you really ought to handsomely reward these builders for their efforts. Uh, right. I'll add that to the tab as well. So we're not getting paid today on that. Uh, okay, <laughs> that's fine. Apprentice for construction, talk to Yan. Uh, he moved rather quickly. But let's go talk to him and see what's up. While we wait for our material to be built, then I gotta go around with my pick hammer and get more bloodstones. And so you see, uh, that mischievous little Mion made a teensy little mistake. When she said that we don't charge for overnight commissions, uh, what she meant to say is that actually, we do. In fact, that's an understatement. We charge out the wazoo for overnight commissions. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know all about the overnight policies. It's just that Mian said she thought she could get us a discount. Yes, well, she's been overruled. Sorry, old pal, but if we made an exception for you, 
We'd have to start making exceptions for everyone, and that would be far too exceptional. <laughs> yeah, well, I wouldn't want to shortchange the good folks over at the Commerce Guild. That's what I love about you, Owen! Always so perfectly punctual with your payments. Well, I must be going. My employees won't reprimand themselves, don't you know? <laughs> so long! Oh, hey! Uh, you've come at just the right time. So, the wildest thing happened. Uh, Grace had a little spat with the oven and, uh, <laughs> long story short, blew the whole kitchen to smithereens. Don't worry. Everyone's fine. And luckily, Mian was available to help out with damage control. So that's all well and good. My issue now is that the night the kitchen exploded, Grace insisted she'd take a pay cut until all the repairs were paid for, and she wouldn't take no for an answer. But now... Now, without Mian's discount, I just can't let Grace foot the bill. She'd be scraping by for months, if not years. Never mind the camel that always seems to make an appearance during a cutscene, right? I paid Yen already. It's water under the bridge in my mind. Cause, you know, these things happen. I, I can't stand letting her take on such a huge burden. She's just a student. Alright, so here's where you come in. As a builder, you can just convince her that the repairs aren't that expensive. <laughs> then she won't feel so bad and maybe she'll just forget about the whole thing. It's foolproof. All right, let's go. All right, uh, but uh, let's not be too hasty now. We need to be prepared if we're really gonna change Grace's mind. She really has a way of turning things around on you. <laughs> uh, maybe she's on the debate team or something. Here's the deal. Whatever she asks you, just follow my lead. Capiche? Don't let her throw you off your game. Stick to the plan. Guess we're as ready as we're ever gonna be. <laughs> Let's go track down Grace. I'll be right behind you. She, she, she's right there. Like, literally, literally, right, right there. All right, let, let's go. Howdy. A lot of people are saying Sandrock is going downhill, but for migrants like me, the cost of living makes it a pretty attractive place. Um, okay. So long, partner. Owen? Alright, so maybe I gotta go talk to Yan first? Okay, so maybe... Okay, I thought when I went down to talk to Yan, that was for talking to the Yan for being apprentice, but apparently that was two different things. Uh, wait, Owen's in here. Well, well, bang up job on the uh, water tower, I must say. You know, it's funny. When you and Mian got here, I bet old Mason the two of you wouldn't last a week. Luckily... He's so far off by now, I doubt I'll ever have to make good on that bet. <laughs> now, uh, where was I? Ah, that's right. You did such a good job of following orders that I've decided on behalf of the Commerce Guild that you deserved a bonus for all your hard work. Seems kind of unusual for you, Yan, but okay. Here's the amount promised by the city and... 50 goals on top. <laughs> that's right. All for you. Don't spend it all in one place. Bye bye now. Uh, so overall, six thousand fifty ghouls. Reputation with Mian and experience. Uh, congratulations, Billy! You've successfully completed all the main story quests in the current early access version. We will continue to update these main quests, among other things, throughout development. You may continue to spend time in Sand Rocks, taking uh, taking commissions from the Kamar Skill, developing your relationship. Yeah, so we pretty much knew all this. Uh, we'll be coming here pretty soon when they said about 30 to 40 hours when I started here. Um, so yeah, now, at least with the main quest lines done, I can actually start gathering materials, making stuff, and putting some, some stuff in storage. So when they do add some things along the way here pretty soon, uh, we'll be ready for it. I know one thing they're getting kind of ready for is multiplayer. They're testing, uh, there's a beta, 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 there's a beta testing going on currently for the multiplayer. Owen, you're following me and I'm not sure why and it started to annoy me. Um, I was talking to Grace, but uh, you didn't do anything about it. 
And I just saw Grace coming here, so let's see if we can track her down. Maybe we gotta go to the kitchen? Uh, let's see, let's go to commissions. Talk to Grace with Owen. Talk to Grace with Owen. I'm trying to... Hey there. Nice work on the water tower builder. I wonder what Logan's next move will be. We've shown that we don't go down easy and whatever whatever sympathy he might uh, garnered before. Haha, -ha, well. Uh, okay. So long, partner. Owen, I'm supposed to be taking your lead. Okay, let's... I guess we'll follow her to the kitchen. All right, so we had to go to the kitchen. Hmm. I just need to put in a bit of salt. Ah, <gasps> uh, thanks, boss. Ah, <laughs> seems someone hasn't quite learned their lesson, but... Uh, that's neither here nor there. Uh, look who I've brought. Your friendly neighborhood builder, here to help us come to a, a conclusion on that whole explosion incident. Oh, hey! And you're still on about that, Owen? That was a terrible mess, and I'm completely to blame. I'll be footing the bill in full for the kitchen restoration, regardless of what you may have told the builder here. Uh, hey, uh, come on, Grace. It's it's no biggie. And and even if it was, the blue moon has plenty set aside for rainy days, or explosive days, for that matter. Anyway, everything is taken care of now, and it hardly cost me a dime. Uh, don't believe me? Just ask for a second opinion here. Owen is winking at me. All right, I'll bite. You plan to tell me the truth now, don't you? Uh, Let's I, begin. Uh, I didn't get what a choice there. What is your name? Uh, huh? Where are you going with this one? I have my reasons. Your name, please? All right, well. Okay, next question. Next, where are you from originally? Uh... I don't really remember. <laughs> High wind, wind, I guess. Nice weather this time of year, yes? Very windy, I've heard. Um, I'm not sure if it is or isn't. That'll do. Now I know what you look like when you're deciding whether or not to answer truthfully. Next, I'll be asking what I really want to know. And don't even think about bending the truth to help Owen change my mind. Got it? I can read you like a book. Now, Builder, tell me. How much did it cost to renovate the Blue Moon Kitchen? Now, see, I really don't know what Owen may have told her, so I... <clears throat> You know, uh, more than a few glasses of milk, <laughs> but less than a herd of yak milk. <sighs> Grace, it's fine. I wish you'd just forget about all this. I'm gonna say ten ghouls. Oh, you're serious. <laughs> I, I, I mean, uh, after the discounts and, uh, you know, the, the Commerce Guild. Owe me some favors and, uh, <laughs> sure, it, it sounds crazy. <laughs> if you two are going to lie, at least try to make it good. Well, let's continue, shall we? Owen's not doing so well, I don't think. The events in question occurred two days prior, and on the second day, when I came to work, the kitchen was already as good as new. Something here doesn't add up. Don't tell me you builders are dabbling in magic. Explain. What's your angle, Grace? The two new builders in town are both riled up and full of vinegar. You're just used to old Mason and his whiny ways. Nothing unusual here, right? Uh, yep, normal. I could do it too. Hmm. I see. Next question. Regardless, Owen must have had to pay me on for working overnight. Tell me how much that would have been. Ah, uh, well, uh... Be that as it may, <laughs> the kind lady that she is, Mian gave me a discount. Uh, the difference in the bill was so small, I almost forgot about it. Yep, just a little more than usual. Okay, next question. <sighs> Grace, 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 Grace. Enough with the third degree. There's really nothing more to be said. Boss, you sure have a lot to say for someone who says there's nothing to say. Why do you always butt in whenever I ask a question, huh? 
It's starting to seem like you two are in cahoots. <laughs> cahoots? I, I mean, uh, what even is a cahoot, really? I think this whole ordeal has you on edge. Uh, but, all right, have it your way. I'll zip it. Continue with the interrogation, please. If something like this happened in the Commerce Guild, would your boss, Yan, handle it like Owen? Which is to say, would he insist on paying the damages out of his own pocket? Um. Well, we all know Yan's uh, all the big heart. I don't want to say no flipping way. I said I don't really know. Yeah, but the thing is, I think you do. You know, at first, I was kind of entertained by this little charade of yours. But, I mean, you could have at least put a little effort into your story. I'm afraid I can't oblige such a pithy performance. I'm sticking to my guns. The kitchen damage falls on me, and that's that. All right, all right. Looks like I won't be able to change your mind. I suppose I could take a hundred goals per month out of your salary, and then... Five hundred. Let's just get it over with. Uh, come on. You'll be just barely scrapping by for months. That's nothing to me. Come on. I already agreed to let you pay. You gotta work with me a little. Stick with 100 a month, alright? Alright, alright. Thank you, Owen. Well, thanks for coming. And at least helping us get this mess sorted out. Sorry to take up so much of your time. Uh, stop by again soon for a drink, won't you? Mission failed. I mean... Okay, fine. Uh, I mean, I, I, how is that really supposed to go? I don't know. But <laughs> mission failed. That That's a new one. I think that's the first mission... Well, I've quit the uh, commissions I've taken because I couldn't get the job done. Uh, but as for side quests and main quest lines, yeah. That didn't work out too well. Anywho... Now, luckily, it's still only 9 o'clock or almost 10 o'clock in the morning. Uh, we got a lot of ghouls, which is good for doing the water tower. And I think we're all set on side stories and whatnot for a while. Watch out for the train. Alright, so bronze pipes are, are... I think we got enough of those done. I think. Um, glass lenses. I can craft two more of those. Alright, so those are done. And what other commission did I have? Oh, the bloodstones. Uh, let's see, Chi wanted the glass lenses. And I need three more bloodstones saws. So that means I need a total of nine bloodstones. All right, uh, pickaxe. And let's see, what else do I need to be making here? Iron plates are being made. Uh, I need iron plates for... Making the steel frame. Well, no, steel frame, I need iron, iron, um, iron witchmaningers. You know those things? You know the iron witchmaningers? Hang on a second here. Where is the steel frame? Uh, yeah, cast iron rods. Sorry. Oh, uh, boy, I need a whole bunch of cast iron rods. And those are made here. Well, I'll get started on one of them at least. Little by little. All right, let me go around and see if I can get some bloodstone cores, which I should be able to. I just got to hammer on some stones. Let's see, I need uh, nine more. Or sorry, seven more, actually. If I do pretty good here, every time I hit one of these, I get one. All right, so there's one. Six more to go. All right, I do believe I got enough to get the rest of these bloodstone saws done. So let's go ahead and make those. Perfect, so I got two commissions to hand in. Uh, everything here is about as good as it can be going here. Let me grab some more steel bars so I can come over here and grab, uh, get some more of these, uh, iron plates going. Uh, while I'm at it as well, uh, let's see, what was, the, what was the other thing I need to make here? Uh, four bronze frames. So do I have enough to make enough bronze frames? Probably not. I can make two. I'm short on rivets. Uh, bronze rivets. Let's see. Do those be made in here? Yep. Let's go ahead and just craft up 
four of those like that. Let's see, I also need hardwood planks. Hardwood planks. Uh, can I make five more of those? Actually, you know what? I'm gonna make. I'm gonna go ahead and make. Uh, no, let's just make five. Just make five. So that'll be for the stable for our baby yak mill. Um, hopefully, at some point. Let's go ahead and hand these commissions in, so I can get some more ghouls in my pocket. So first one's gonna be with Chi. While we're up there with Chi, we're just gonna check our research. Like I said, I think we got everything researched, but we'll just double check. Now he's not going to be too thrilled with the glass lenses because he never is. Sand Rock Commission appears usable. Thanks. All right, uh, no problem, but the workshop reputation goes up, experience goes up, everything looks good. Let's head out the door. Now, someone else I probably should start getting giving uh, giving gifts to is Zeke, who runs the farm. Um, if I'm going to start getting into cooking, oh, that reminds me, I, I got to do some cooking stuff. Uh, I got to figure that out. Oh, that could take me a while. Uh, that's a good thing I might be able to do the rest of the day. And then, since we do know we're done with uh, side story quest lines for a while, I can start going to ruins. I'm out of material to make steel bars. I'm also out of material to make bronze bars, so I need more tin. Need a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, Hugo. Hey there. Uh, hey there. Alrighty, not bad, not bad. Well, here's your payment. Don't do anything with it. I wouldn't. See ya. Perfect. So now I just got, is it just the noodles? And I also got to find cheese relic over in the abandoned ruins. Well, it's not the abandoned ruins, but the one across the bridge. That's the one I got to get over there on. But let's see if I can figure out the noodles here. I may do a little bit of off camera because that's going to be hit or miss, I think, for a little bit. Uh, I only got a few amount of peppers. Let's see here. I got my recipe here. Uh, yeah, bone broth. I got some some bones, I think, somewhere. Let's see how we're doing. Oh, we're up to 1,200 points above Yan now, so that's good. Mian is in third place. And as for the other two... I haven't seen these two workers at all, so I'm not really sure what they're doing. Have no idea. Uh, let me just double check, make sure I can't take any more quests. Uh, not that I probably want to take any more, but let's see. Can I take three of them now a day? Nope. So still only two a day, but that's fine. Uh, I would only take a quest that I could know I could finish right now. It would be something cheap and easy. All right, drool with joy noodles. Um, does it give me give me any more information? Using a handmade noodles plus fresh and tender meat, boil a pot of bone soup base and add some green vegetables. It should be delicious. Ooh, it, ooh, I don't got got many uh, much time on that though. It did show one day, sixteen hours. All right, so I got I really got to focus on that, I guess. Because if I go in 50-50 with them, it'd be good. Let's see, we got flour. A whole bunch of flour. Uh, Bone-based broth. I don't think that was over here. Um, do I need to upgrade this station, though, to get that, maybe? Let's see, steel frame. Do I have enough to make a steel frame now? all the way down here. Uh, I need two more cast iron rods. Alright, so I don't have enough to make the steel frame. And my inventory is full. Go ahead and sort that as best I can. Alright, there is that. 
Uh, Alright, so I'm going to fiddle around a little bit, see if I can figure out this recipe. Um, it might be just all hit or miss, so I'm not too sure. It may take me a moment to get it all figured out. Alright, I'm not going to lie, I looked up this recipe because I would have never figured it out. Uh, <laughs> definitely would not have figured it out. So we want to come into it, you got to at least have the apprentice cooking station. I haven't upgraded this yet because I'm not going to have the materials for it today, I don't think. Uh, we got to uh, activate the cooking pot, and this is what we got to do. Uh, we got to add flour, and then uh, we got to add, let's see, where is it? Alfalfa, which I had to go to the Blue Moon Saloon to acquire. So we're going to add alfalfa. And then we want rib meat, which I had to go out and get, uh, kill a few yak meals before I got one. And then we want just regular meat, like that. And then for the spices, we got to add the uh, seaside pepper blend. And then we should just hit confirm. And voila, drool with joy noodles. Yeah, I would have figured that out. Um, when I said, uh, I forgot what he said. I originally wrote down, let's see, flour. Uh, let's see, I wrote down alfalfa. Uh, but he told us bone bone broth, flour, leafy, uh, leafy vegetables. And then, yeah, so I, I would have never guessed that. So I looked it up and uh, yeah, I would have been there forever. Let's go hand in this right now. Yeah, my inventory is rather full. I got to figure out my inventory. Uh, situation. Uh, I got to get some bigger boxes, uh, start sorting the stuff out. But hopefully when I go over to the other ruins, um, I can get some more relics, build some more relics. And that's taking up a lot of my inventory as it is. But I definitely got to go over there and get more material. We can start gathering up on that. We can just focus now on our commissions by the day. That's all I really need, need the materials for. And I want to start uh, handing out more gifts rather than to Amira. I definitely want to go over and see Zeke. I think Zeke, if I remember correctly, would like do collectors, and so would I, but those are rather cheap, and, I'm, and I should be able to become very good friends with him really quick by doing mm, that. The savory broth. I can feel it in my joints. Is that yak mill I taste? Excellent choice. Oh, and the noodles are so fresh, and the veggies really balance out the spice. Even my wife would love this, and she's... Whoop! <laughs> Needles almost made me spill the beans. Builder, you've done it. This dish is exquisite. I'm going to take this across the free cities. I surmise that the demand will be high. Gosh, you don't know how many other people I went through trying to get this recipe right. Me either. But you, you're the one. I'm Neil. The one who can bend noodles to your very will. I think I'll call them Chaji Mala Tono Dele Pleasantatious Man. That's sea scion for makes you drool with joy. Okay. Because they make me drool. I'm going to trademark that. Eh, anyway, I'm going to start talking to restaurant owners in other cities. Meanwhile, feel free to start selling the recipe around here in Sandrock. Maybe you can work something out with that saloon guy. What's his name? Joe? Just don't sell the recipe for anything less than 200 goals. Got me? Okay. We're pals now, so I'm going to share with you a couple tricks of the trade. First rule of making a deal, you got to ease into it. Don't just strike straight at the heart of the matter. Ask them about their family or something. Remember how I did? Second rule. Always let them know you've got other options. Make them desperate. That's all. I'll be on my way. I'll send you any profit share later. Yeah, like I said, I would have never guessed that. Uh... Oh, I was like, uh, what's with the question mark? I'd speak to Owen. Um, I would have never guessed that recipe whatsoever. So I was like, I'm going to look that up because that's a lot. Of, you know, how do I make bone broth? I, I thought I had to make the bone broth and then make something else. Uh, but that made it a lot easier, it seemed. Uh, anywho, I'm not going to speak with Owen just yet. I'm going to leave that for another day uh, because it's already 5 o'clock in the afternoon. I got some stamina I would like to go ahead and use on up um, while things are being made. I think I'm going to go over... Uh, I may go over to the abandoned ruins here to get some get some uh, tin so I can make bronze bars. But yeah, I got to come back over here to the gecko station ruins. And yeah, I got to gather up some material to make more steel bars because I need to make more iron plates. So we can go ahead and get ourselves a barn for our baby yak mill. Then we can start feeding them. 
I'm not really sure. I mean, uh, maybe grow some wheat. Maybe I, I should do some wheat, but I can probably buy food from Cooper. And of course, I want to be able to upgrade our cooking station as well. But now when I come over to here, no, nope, that's the wrong one. Here, if I go to recipes, now we got with the uh, Drool with Joy noodles. So I can go ahead. What does that actually do for me here? I forgot what it's supposed to do for me. Yeah, never mind my inventory. My inventory is a mess. Uh, what does that do? Uh, minimum damage by 12%, max damage by 12%, lasts for 30 seconds. Okay, I was looking more for stamina, so uh, I guess I could sell that kind of stuff. But yeah, we can uh, upgrade our cooking station. Uh, there's a few more of the things I can upgrade here as well. Like the grinder, I can upgrade that to a civil grinder. But then everything else is going to be maxed out. Oh, I got I got a recycling here, but yeah, we're pretty much maxed out in everything here. And then we can just kind of focus on, like I said, doing commission guilds. Um, but our stable, I like to put my stable over here. Or barn for our baby yak mill. We can start running our yak mill around. And then uh, I may go ahead and move the farm. Uh, but the farm seems to fit here okay for now. Plus we already got moisture in the ground here. So I may keep it like that, but we'll see. Uh, anyways, I'm rambling on. I'm, I'm, I'm wasting time of the day and I need to get to the ruins. But that's going to be it for today, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. I do appreciate you watching as always. I'll catch you again right here at my time at Sandrock. But until then, have a good one.